Hey everyone, my name is Tom Pounder. I'm the online campus pastor here at New Life Christian Church, and along with my friend Brendan Loveless, we host the Third Chair Podcast. And what we've really enjoyed about these podcasts is that everybody's story is different. However, what I love about this episode is that we've all gone through those times in our lives where we're wondering, hey, God, are you there? God, are you with me? As I'm going through this situation in my life, are you there? And what we see oftentimes is that God says, I, I've got you. I'm, I'm there with you. And that's what we see here in Carrie Smith's life. And Carrie Smith is joined by uh, her husband, David, who we've interviewed in the past. But I'm also joined by Andy Spray, who's filling in for Brennan in this episode. And we just get to have a great conversation about how God was with Carrie and David through a really tough time in their life as they were processing some life decisions. And we get to see how God really revealed himself and said, I got you. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to share a little teaser trailer right now. But I want to encourage you to go into the show notes and click on the link for the full episode. We're on Apple. We're on Amazon. We're on Spotify. Click on the platform that you most subscribe to and just listen to the full episode and be encouraged in your faith today. All right. So without any further ado, here's the teaser trailer. Through this whole thing, like always knowing God is faithful and just looking back and how everything has just fallen into place and where we are today, it's just so much that we are faithful to God, you know, with our tithe and with, you know, serving and, you know, helping others. And then he's just like, I got you. Like, like yes, you might've felt alone. You were not alone. I was, I was with you this whole time. And let me show you, this is an example. This is an example. And then one of the best examples is we had three embryos left. And so we, when you sign up for IVF, you're like, are you gonna, what do you wanna do with, if you if you have any em leftover embryos, you can discard them, you can donate them to science, or you can donate them to like another family. So we knew uh, we wanted to help somebody else because knowing the struggle, and since we've been through this, like while we were going through this, we knew that like one family that had struggle with infertility. Since we've gone through this, there's been so many families that have, and we're able to like pour into them because we know what it's like. 